especially with food. You don't want to know where it came from, okay? Especially yeah. stuff from, from when you know when you say a child made it. Because all I can think about is their dirty fingernails, you know. <laughs> and that's why instead of me eating their baked stuff, can I just give you the two dollars for the margin? going on got a good topic for me today <laughs> <laughs> yes a topic okay i got one i got one so you know school school started for my kids and yep. you know this is considered the fall right they start in the yep. fall it's not really fall but anyway <laughs> so what that means to me is that I'm going to get bombarded by fundraiser stuff. <laughs> yeah. Okay? Yep. Bombarded, and then yep. there's always the Christmas fundraiser. And so last year, I I try to look up, how much are these schools making? What's what's the margin? Okay, what, <laughs> what exactly is the margin? And I don't know what I was looking up, but sometimes the margin can range from 10 to 25 percent on average maybe and as okay. high the highest i've seen 50 percent but those are on candles candles <laughs> these 20 or 30 dollar candles man ridiculous yeah, I, I don't use candles of course not and nor nor do you shop at kohl's okay russ you, no you don't buy candles and you don't shop at Kohl's like women, okay? That's not that's not our thing, okay? So anyway, yep. so so I'm thinking, especially for these, okay, even if they're mini fundraisers, okay, mini ones, like out of nowhere, maybe a church thing, I don't know, maybe all of a sudden they want to sell twenty dollar magazine subscriptions, I don't know, it doesn't matter. Say something's twenty bucks, they're trying to get me. To spend twenty dollars, but what is their margin? If their margin is ten percent, twenty percent, then that's two to four dollars, right? Mm -hmm. So they're trying to make two to four dollars off of me. You, you know, is you know the question is, can I just give you two to four dollars? Can I give <laughs> yeah. the school two to four dollars? I'll just write a check. The, the thing. You yeah. know, write a check. Forget the. The whole fundraiser you know i i don't want to spend 20 if you're only gaining two to four dollars yeah you got to make a certain amount to make it worth it right i don't know what the i don't know what that amount is or like girl scouts too right girl scouts sell their cookies mm -hmm. how much do they make i want to know i want to know because yeah, i want to know too well look what the the um the girl scout foundation or whatever they're making their money automatically because the parents have to buy the cookies, right? I don't know. I yeah. don't know if that's how it works. Who knows? But then part of the money goes to the whatever, a league or their scout, whatever. I don't know what it's What is this? Their, their gang? Their Girl Scout gang? What yeah. is that? Their, whatever it is. Their little group. Okay? <laughs> so how much? How much goes to the little group? I, I don't know. I don't know how much they pay... The cook company that makes the cookies. Okay. Because you could you could buy those cookies at Aldi's. You could buy those cookies at Walmart. They're like a dollar eighty two or something like that. It's under two dollars. Right. I do it all the time. I know because Thin you're mints, a bad person, Thin Russ. Mints. You're bad. <laughs> you don't like the Girl yeah, Scouts. So, That's why you do it. <laughs> so if I buy those cookies, I'm not supporting the Girl Scouts. But the Girl Scouts only comes out once a year. Mm -hmm. And if I want those cookies in the middle of the year, I'm not going to wait around for, for a whole year. I'm just going right. to get it. Right. I'll put, I'll put a photo up. Uh, the, these are from Aldi's, actually. But I've seen them also from Walmart. Well, if I can find those, I'll put that up, too. Five bucks. Let's say they are five bucks. And what do they get? 20%? That's a, what was that, Um, a dollar? Is it a dollar? They, they, or a dollar twenty five. Because that. Hmm? Because at retail, at retail, these these other cookies cost me a dollar eighty something. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking something like that. So the, obviously, all these must make some profit from it. So those cookies can't cost that much. So so maybe Girl Scouts do make a certain amount 
on the sale of the cookies. The question now really is not how much they make, it's how much do they actually use for Girl Scout activities. I mean, am I paying a certain amount of money and part of it goes to the to the troop leader because that's her salary? Uh, you, you know what I'm saying? You, you know what? I'm not going to go into how they spend the money. I'm more into, can I just give you the margin? Yeah. Can I just, if just you're only going to make, be done with it. if you're going to make $1 off the $5 box, I'll just give you the dollar so I don't have to spend the five. <laughs> I'll give you $2 and I'll spend the other $2 at Aldi. Both people, <laughs> look at that. Problem solved. <laughs> Problem. Give half your money to the Girl Scouts, the other half to Aldi. That's 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 uh, a better I, way. I guess you could. It's a better way. I'm <laughs> donating directly to their. What what are they called? What are these groups called? Their gang. Their gangs. Their troops. I don't, I don't know, know, man. Their troops. Their gang. <laughs> Girl Scout <laughs> gang. <laughs> They're uh. What are these things? They're troop. Yes, there's the Girl Scout troops and the Boy Scout troop. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> you know, oh, look, look, look. Same, look, same thing. Same thing with um, how, how they encourage school kids to sell. If they sell a certain amount, they get a prize, right? You know? Say, say they sell uh, 50 okay. bucks worth. Know, they? Sometimes uh -huh. they, they have a catalog. They have a catalog of stuff you can get if you sell a certain amount of money. You know, if you make a certain amount of money. So if you sell Turning 50 them bucks. Turning salespeople. Yeah, no, no, no. This, this has been going on for a long time. <laughs> at least, uh, what, yeah. maybe a, at the earliest 30 years, you know? Uh -huh. Or the latest 30 years. But 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 anyway, um, say you sell 50 bucks worth of candy or Christmas candy. I don't know. <laughs> whatever. Christmas themed <laughs> stuff you can get a dinky three cent spider ring you know <laughs> you you can do this see and then this is this is where you know how do you explain to a child son i'm not gonna sell a hundred dollars worth of these you know these turtle caramel candy things okay i'm not but you want to get this ten dollar item that's on the prize list i'll just buy it <laughs> <laughs> I'll buy it. It's ten. But actually, you know what? It's probably eight bucks online. Okay, I can yeah. just buy it. You don't have to sell a hundred dollars worth. Okay, it's not about selling a hundred dollars worth. It's I don't like to sell overpriced stuff to the people that I know, right. particularly the coworkers. Right. Actually, you know what? Screw the coworkers. They can, <laughs> they can go buy it. That's what they're for, right? You sell them yeah. Avon. You sell them. It your your child's fundraiser stuff, right? I don't know what you sell your coworkers. <laughs> Jeez. And why is it the parents have to do all the selling and the kids just kind of reap in the benefit? <laughs> so they don't get kidnapped going door to door, Ross. That's why. Yeah. yeah That's and, why. Okay, when when I was growing up, they used to have school bake sales. They don't have that anymore. You can't trust anybody's baked goods. <laughs> no, I don't trust anyone's baked goods because the scariest thing that that <laughs> that someone ever made me realize there is a lady, okay? We can't go into specifics here. She's making some cookies, and things are just not really sanitary, okay? And here she is <laughs> stuffing her hand in whatever, the batter, whatever. I don't know what that stuff is. And her kids are, yeah. suppo her kids are supposed to be making them. And something unsanitary just happened. I don't remember, but she, 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 she looks at me in, the fi in, in my face and says, that's why you don't trust cookies made by families, <laughs> by kids. And she's still mixing it. I don't know what she's doing. I don't know. And it scared the crap out of me because I'm thinking, wow, this is why the term ignorance is bliss makes sense, right? You know? <laughs> Especially with food. You don't want to know where it came from. Okay? Especially yeah. stuff from, from when, you know, when you say a child made it. Because all I can think about is their dirty fingernails, you know? <laughs> And that's why instead of me eating their baked stuff, can I just give you the two dollars for the margin? Yeah, okay. Exactly. Okay, that means I gotta roll out, Ross. I really gotta roll out. This this food is disgusting. I don't want to buy gift wrap fundraising. Right? That's terrible. I'm rolling out. And candles. Screw the candles. <laughs>
<laughs> Bake sales, fundraisers. Oh. Comment below. <laughs> What's your experience been? Hey, and if you are a Girl Scout or a Boy Scout leader and you know what the margins are, let us know. <laughs> Comment below. If you like the video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and definitely hit the bell icon. that will let you know when new videos come out from us. Talk to you guys next time.